a very good morning to my dear 10th standard students this is our history class and today we shall continue with the chapter mass media and history before we go ahead with the chapter let us do a recap of all the things we studied in the previous class we started the chapter by understanding the concept mass media and the different means of mass media we also studied about the history of mass media how in the ancient times the information was passed from one person to another orally and then with the arrival of the britishers printing technology was introduced in our country and the information was passed with the help of newspapers we also studied why newspapers provided the people with news of all the fields and hence it became the first medium of circulating information and knowledge among the people we also studied the precursors of newspapers which means what similar things came before newspapers during the ancient time in egypt in rome and during the time of emperor ashoka in our country we also studied about bengal gazette the first english newspaper of our country which was printed on 29th of january 1780 it was also called as calcutta general advertiser or bengal gazette started by james augustus hickey an irish gentleman the next newspaper which we had studied was darpan which covered the news of political economic social and cultural events of the society which was started in 1832 in mumbai by bal shastri jambekar today we shall go ahead with the chapter let us first understand the newspaper prabhakar which was started by bahu mahajan the newspaper aimed at creating social awareness among the people and therefore the news printed in this newspaper created social awareness let us now learn about dyanoday dyanoday had a lot of achievement what was that it printed the map of asia in 1842 and the map of europe in the year 1851 the honor of printing an illustration in an indian newspaper for the first time goes to dyanoday other than these things there were many other news covered by the newspaper let us look at them one by one the news of installation of telegraph the news of starting of railways in our country and the news of indian war of independence of 1857 was covered by this newspaper let us now look at the other newspapers the newspaper indu prakash supported widow remarriage the newspaper din bandhu covered the issues relating to the masses the next newspaper which we shall study is the kesri and the maratha it represented an important stage in the history of indian newspaper before independence it was started by gopal ganesh agarkar and bal gangadhar tilak what did these two people speak about they spoke about the social and political issues of that period and hence what was happening in the society was written down 
in these two newspapers that is Kesri and Maratha. In the 21st century, newspapers have continued to fulfill an important role and therefore it was acknowledged as the fourth column of democracy. Look at the achievement of the newspapers. After understanding newspapers, let us go to the next medium of mass media, that is the magazines and the journals. What are magazines and journals? They are periodical publication. The next question which comes into our mind is when they are published, they are published weekly that is once in a week. Some magazines and journals are published bi-weekly that is twice in a week. There are some who come monthly that is once in a month. Some bi-monthly twice in a month. Some quarterly that is once in four months. Some are published six quarterly once in six months. Some annual that is once in a year. And some journals and magazines are published at no fixed time. The first monthly magazine in Marathi. What was that? Do you want to know about it? Yes, the first monthly magazine which was in Marathi is Dik Darshan. Which was started by Bal Shastri Jambhekar. Now it's time to know about the first periodical of our country. The first periodical of our country is Pragati, which was edited by Trimbak Shankar Shezwalkar. Now children, apart from these magazines and journals, we had some Marathi journals which were only devoted to Indian history. They were Bharatiya Itihas Ani Samskruti and Marathwada Itihas Parishat Patrika. These are the two examples of the Marathi journals which devoted to Indian history. Thank you children for your attention. In the next class, we will be doing the lesson further. I hope you, you might have understood the chapter. If there is any doubt in your mind, kindly write it down in your book. And inshallah, when we meet in the school, I will be clearing all your doubts. Thank you. Take care.